Next, we'll go into the Training Manager. This section offers the ability to manage training campaigns and coordinate their delivery to different user groups according to the needs of the business. Within this section of the platform, there's the facility to create or select from templates the emails that will be used to inform the user community of the training requirements. The emails can be tokenized to personalize them to specific users and groups, and they can also be branded according to your corporate standards. Additionally, messages can be sent both pre- and post-training to further personalize the experience for users. Under the main Training Campaign section of the interface, you can see the pre-existing campaigns that have been created, assigned, and published. The completion status of completed training campaigns is also available. If we want to create a new training campaign, we simply select the wizard. As with other management components of the Cyber Risk Aware platform, there is a rich array of pre-existing content on email security, social engineering, authentication, and many more. Note also the sub-categories available. This offers users the ability to have broad knowledge in all areas of personal information security and acquire the best practices associated with each subject area. Once we've selected a training course, we can save the changes and then begin to specify the pre- and post-messages the users will receive. We can also preview the video content associated with a specific activity. Once we've specified the scheduled start and end dates for the training, we choose the templates associated with assigning, reminding, and completing the training content. Finally, as before within Cyber Risk Aware, we allocate the training to a group or groups of users. After completing this part of the configuration, we have a finished training campaign. Once the training has been scheduled, it will automatically publish at the specified date and users will be alerted to its availability. Again, the training appears within the Cyber Risk Aware portal for the users who are due to receive it. The training is delivered in situ within the solution, and once users have viewed the training, they are marked as having completed it. This means that meaningful management information about the completion of the training against specific goals is available within the Cyber Risk Aware portal. It also helps underline to auditors and regulatory authorities that the organization is training their staff and meeting their obligations. Central control and administration of the cyber security training function within an organization is easily delivered in this way with Cyber Risk Aware. This significantly reduces the risk of users falling victim to the elaborate and increasingly sophisticated fraudulent activity used by attackers today.